Hello friends, this is Durga from Mightyversity. As part of HTPCD Spark certification using Python as programming language, let's deep dive into another important category of the certification, which is Spark SQL. And uh, here is the agenda. We will first see the objectives, and then we will actually go through the problem statement, and then uh, the rest of the stuff to understand um, the topics that are relevant for Spark SQL. Here are the objectives from the curriculum that is published by Hortonworks itself. Uh, we will start with creating Spark data frames from an existing RDD. And we have learned about RDD as part of the earlier module. And then we try to perform operations on the data frame, write a Spark SQL application, use Hive with ORC from Spark SQL, and write a Spark SQL application that reads and writes data from Hive tables. And based upon the published objectives, the curriculum is uh, chosen uh, even though the uh, words are ex not exactly the same as for the objectives but they can be easily related between the agenda and the objectives uh, uh, that are taken from the certific certification curriculum so here is the data model which we will be using the data model simulates a online e-commerce platform and it has six tables in it uh, customers, orders, order items, products, categories, and departments. Out of these six tables, um, orders and order items are transactional tables. Whenever a customer try to buy some products by placing an order, there will be, a, there will be an entry which will be made into orders. And if there, if there are more than one item that are placed, for each item, there will be an entry in order items. So orders and order items are transactional tables in this uh, um, module of an e-commerce platform which is nothing but order management system and then customers um, will store the customer level details which is kind of master data and then product catalogs um, product catalog is normalized into three tables products categories and departments okay the so products are grouped into categories categories are grouped into departments uh, hence, there is a relationship as well between these three tables, and these three are also master data tables. And now, if you look at the problem statement, it has multiple uh, things in the pro uh, problem statement. First, the problem statement says to create orders and order items tables in Hive database in text file format and load data into tables, and then in ORC file format into which we need to insert the data. And then we have to come up with query uh, where we have to get daily revenue by product translating complete and closed orders. And also data need to be sorted in ascending order by date and then descending order by revenue. Uh, and the final out output has to be stored into Hive database, uh, your user ID underscore daily underscore revenue. Okay. And you can uh, give whatever table name you want. Uh, when you this is the database and probably you can give the table name such as daily revenue python or daily revenue whatever you want okay and to uh, to run or uh, to process the data for uh, last uh, last three topics in the problem statement we can get orders and order items from hive database which we created as part of the first step of the problem statement and then uh, data for products is available locally in this location we should be able to read the data create data frame and join with other two tables so we should uh, be able to use the existing hive data and also uh, data which came from uh, outside tables and the, finally the solution need to be stored in this location on the local file system of the gateway node and we will see that as we proceed. Uh, 